trying to get somewhere in the hurry. In my best life, cuz. Sweet smell of gas. Yeah, that's a nice Camaro. They got LS3 in there. 6.2 liter. That's nice. So today well right now we're gonna head to the zoo yeah we're gonna meet the family down at the zoo um the thing about living in Richmond County you don't gotta pay for the zoo on Fridays if you didn't know now you know Fridays zoo is free so why pay when you can go for free on Fridays um so, little thing about the other day, we did a big ride um, to Charlotte, and I kind of messed up. Well, I big messed up. I forgot to put, I put the wrong adapter in my mic. I put the three ring adapter when I only had, needed two. Um, and I ended up, not having no audio, I have video, but no audio. You big dummy. Which I'm going to still use that video for something. I'm gonna make it into something, use my cinematography skills and make it into something. Um, it's not that the quality is good, but it's not that great of a video anyway, because that light wasn't gonna change, I'm on a motorcycle. Um, because this was my first time recording a video, so the GoPro was pointing downward. Um, and with it pointing downward, you saw a lot of my upper dash, but you didn't see, you know, a lot of the stuff that was going on around me. So we're gonna end up with that over. We've been So we're downtown now. 
Um, crazy part, all of this over there, where the baseball stadium at, it was a asylum. Like, they put offices in there. You know what I mean? People probably had experiments done on them. Crazy stuff. And you sitting in your office where they was done that. It's kind of like, I've been watching this show called Manifest. Came out like 2018, I think. 2019. I don't know when it came out. But it was about some people. They went into like the Bermuda Triangle. Ooh, that lock was on the ground. That would have been bad. I would hit that lock. They went to the Bermuda Triangle. They were gone for like five years. So then they come back and like they think they only took a straight red line flight to home. This is downtown Columbia. Um, we're not deep down here, but we're downtown. I don't know if it's a red light or if this traffic. Hopefully it's a red light. Please don't say it. Cause they are gonna flip out if I'm late. You know, too late getting over here. But look, the downtown Columbia. Oh, yeah. This car is riding my foot. Scene is like better at the beach. Nah, here is more consistent people to ride with. Um, you're not always, you know, the beach is like hit and miss. Whoa, it look like it's packed out here. It's like hit and miss. Um, but here is more consistently, you're gonna have the same people that you ride with, you're gonna get that same group. Um, and that, that makes the ride. But, I mean, sometimes it is good to have, you know, other people ride along with you. But having those people that, you know, consistently to ride with, where you're not fighting to find somebody to ride. Like, it's, it's a lot of us. Total is probably around 50, 60 of us that ride together um, on a given day. So, yeah, so that's, that's the bike scene here. Um, there's a lot of people here. It is packed um, here. It's early, man. Early in the year, and get the little boy. But yeah, it's it's a lot of people here right now. That's a nice little Fendi. He got exhaust on it. Ooh, I think that's a. 35? I may be wrong. But yeah, it's a. Yeah, this is packed. It is packed out here. There's a lot of people out here. I'm gonna park right here.
so just got done at the zoo they are closing it's starting to get dark temperature starting to drop pretty cool I see like the bears rustling all of it I forgot my biking gear Parking lot look way different than when we came. Um, we're gonna head downtown. Go through downtown. Probably go up two nights, see if anybody at one of the spots we meet at. I'm in part of soap on this thing. Luckily, there's no stoplight up here. A few moments later. Boy, this tent advisor sure does help. Um, so I have the Bell Qualifier DLX MIPS. Um, has the Pro Tent. Uh, I don't know how to say it. But it has the transition, it's kind of like a transition visor. Um, it doesn't get too dark, doesn't be too light. But it doesn't get too dark, that's the thing to say. It gets dark enough to keep that sunlight. And here, that sun, um, when you head in the west, it'll sit right there in your face sometimes a year. Sometime during the year, so. It's, it's like right here, beaming straight into the helmet but that visor helps we're gonna hop on the highway 